So Boiler Room have some new pieces out for their full 2024 collection. Randomly, actually, randomly Boiler Room had Cobra Snake shoot it, you know. Cobra Snake, the legendary party photographer, is now back in vogue because everyone's doing this whole, like, fake redux of the Y2K trend, right? Everyone's trying to re replay that and where the certain trends from the early 2000s and whatever, you know, things come in cycles. So I guess this flash photography, this photography in general of clubs and shit is now becoming a thing. And Cobra Snake has now been having a bit of a renaissance. Even though he's still been doing his thing, he's now had a bit of a renaissance. I think the biggest thing that he's done recently that everyone's kind of culturally spoke about was the was the Charlie XCX, I think, birthday party that she did somewhere in New York. So he took a lot of the pictures in there and they look pretty cool. Um, loads of nostalgia involved in that. So he's now doing it with Boiler Room, which is pretty cool. Um, which might be a bit odd because I think nowadays I feel like the trend now, most clubs, most festivals, most nights, is to have the no photo, no photo policy. But if you want to do the whole Y2K trend, you're going to have to let people go in with clubs, with cameras and with the flash on. Because that was a big part of clubbing back then. You'd always like have the flash flickering at the corner of your eye someone would be taking pictures somewhere so that you know it's probably a bit of a it's probably a little friction going on there but regardless let's see what the collection is saying this cuts your boiler room it's a shot by cobra snake um the 424 2024 edition of the london oh at the london festival as well so this was shot at the london festival so let's see who was featured here so who was featured on the london festival all the people featured and actually let's see to get close so you've got your quintessential boiler room um t-shirt which i've always been a big fan of the logo is pretty cool you got one with the with that with that fucking graphic that everyone's getting tattooed on them that's all that weird gothic flame sort of thing going on which i'm not too mad at, at all um another one with the same sort of type of logo um this is well featured with a small boiler room print on there that's actually that might be one of my favorites i think that actual t-shirt might be my favorite that's a really nice one um you've also got this jacket all oh, the parkers are nice isn't it you got a really cool jacket. It looks like it's been tie dyed with two really big front pockets there. It's like a shell jacket in blue. I like the look of that. I think the same jacket as well comes in green. Uh, you've got another tie dye print t shirt here with a boiler room logo. You've got a t shirt here that features an image. Oh, awesome. They're doing a photo print now, things as well. That's pretty cool. You've got this little dot t shirt printed on there on the hoodie. You've got another tonal. I like that actually. The tonal t shirt is pretty sick. That's nice. I'm not mad at that at all. Oh, yeah. Big up Lolo. Big up, big up, big up my girl Lolo. But Lolo's in there as well. What's she wearing? That's another. That's a boiler room t shirt that features a really cool graphic. I'm not sure who does the artwork, but that artwork is pretty cool. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's an angelic lady with, with wings and headphones on and roses all around her. It looks pretty cool with tie dye as well. Big up Lolo. Um,. We've got, what else was that there? Oh, we've got some knit sweatshirts, actually. Pretty cool. We've got some knit boiler room sweatshirts. Of all. To be fair, this is a bit naff. I don't think I'd wear this. This is a little bit cringe. These knit sweatshirts, as nice as they are, they're a bit cringe. But, you know, maybe it's just me. The, the t there's, the, there's also a towel available. Another t-shirt. Another jacket. We've got another hoodie here as well. And again, the long sleeve. But yeah, the stuff is really good. The stuff is really fucking good. I'm not going to lie. Holy Techno hoodie. I don't like the little metal loops on the drawstrings here. Look a bit shit. Not not liking that. There's another jacket. Oh, look at that jacket. That jacket is fucking fire. It's like a what? Is that, is, it, is that a moto jacket? Is that a bomber jacket? That looks pretty nice. Not mad at that as well. Yeah, yeah the towel's hard, isn't it? Yeah, the towel's really nice. The towels are obviously a no-brainer, especially for, you know, boiler room events. Notoriously never have air conditioning, no matter where they are. Even if they're outside, there's no air conditioning. So that's pretty good. Uh, I'd love a fan as well. I'm not going to lie. I'd love a fan too. That graphic is harder. Wherever that graphic is, this is this is maybe my, 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 my most favorite. This graphic here with this sort of like heart graphic-y type style thing going on. I love, I love that. Um, again, the knit sweatshirt. Oh, the knit sweatshirt here looks pretty decent. Hmm. I don't know, man. I don't know if I'd wear the. I mean, it looks a bit. It's like, are you begging? I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's just my my head, my pride and shit. It looks like you're begging it. Do you know what I mean wearing this sort of stuff? Like you're begging it, like to work there or something. Do you know what I mean with this massive fucking boiler room on the knit sweat? I don't know, but it looks still cool. Oh, look at the. Oh, okay, the graphic on that tee is really nice. That is really fucking nice. I'm not gonna lie. I would have loved this in a long sleeve. I swear to God, I would have loved this um, boiler room tee with this fucking demonic angel woman with headphones on, 
I would have loved this in a long sleeve. This in a long sleeve would be so sick in tie dye. That would be so fucking cool. But uh, alas, it's just a t-shirt. And then we've also got a classic hoodie as well. Oh, is that is that diamond? Is that been be bejeweled? Oh, we got a bejeweled hoodie too. I'm not mad at that as well. And then that's it. So yeah, big up uh, photography by Cobra Snake. And then we've also got another one collaboration that they put together with Umbro. You seen this? They've also got collaboration with Umbro. Umbro collaboration, bro. We partnered with Umbro on our second collaborative collection, a uniquely sports coded club capsule primed with a dance floor and pitch. So again, I'd much rather if you're gonna wear like club clothes, you'd probably be wore more I think it's probably a good idea to wear this stuff than the is it the stuff made by what's his fucking name? I've got the DJ. Is it four four club four four? Oh, oh, I forgot what the fucking name is. But that's what stuff is super expensive and you know overpriced. Even zero three two C sort of stuff is. You know, I love the magazine. You know, the stuff is overpriced. I think I'd prefer to wear stuff like this, right? Like from from streaming platforms. You know, you wear like kindred clothing, whore clothing, boiler room. That that would be pretty cool because they're gonna make some cool shit, and they're actually investing in it. It looks like they've got actual designers working there. Like, this stuff is really cool. And Umbro's a dead brand as well. Like, Umbro's a fucking dead brand. And this is pretty fucking cool. Apart from the stuff they do with, like, Japanese brands, collaborations. But this track jacket is really nice. You've got this nice track jacket in, like, a black and a grey. To be fair, it's kind of... It kind of looks a little bit Uber delivery driver, right? If that had a hood on it, that might look like a delivery driver type of jacket type of thing. But I still don't mind it. You've got this Wrangland sleeve track jacket with, I think, 3M piping. I think these this is like 3M piping, I'm pretty sure. And you've got logos on the chest. You've got an Umbro logo and a Boiler Room logo on either side. And I think they're also 3M. And you've also got the Umbro logo here, which is pretty cool on the sweatshirt. You've got the Umbro sort of like um, diamond logo thing. And then underneath in Umbro font, you've got written Boiler Room. That's pretty, that's pretty hard, I'm not going to lie. That's pretty fucking hard. And I'm sure that's a tracksuit that matches. You've also got a jersey here. An actual kit jersey is pretty cool, um, which I don't mind as well. Uh, there's the chat. There's a jacket. Oh, that jacket. No, that that's hard. I'll take it back. Even if it does look like an Uber delivery driver, that's fucking. I'd wear the fuck out of that. That is really fucking good. That track jacket is fucking amazing. I don't mind that. Oh, you can also wear it without no t-shirt. I don't think you could do that if you're black because we sweat a lot. So maybe you might need to do a t-shirt underneath that. There's again the jersey also comes in a long sleeve, in navy blue. I'm not mad at that in the slightest. They also, oh, and there's a hoodie there's a hoodie too that's pretty cool in black there's another t-shirt jersey again in oh they all, there's also some shorts i'm not mad at that especially going out i'm not mad at that some shorts and a pair of Do dr martins and the shit at the club Yoy. maybe i'm should do a, a collaboration with dr martins that'd be pretty cool but yeah the jersey's nice the shorts are nice the jackets are nice but obviously the standout piece the standout piece has to be that track jacket that track jacket with the hopefully it comes with matching track pants i'm sure it does that's definitely the standout piece and as per usual when it comes to pricing boyroom do a good job too because i think it's always re fairly fairly priced in my opinion um considering it's like merch considering it's like elevated merch let's not even call it merch i think it's quite insulting to say it's just merch i think it's like elevated merch i think the pricing is pretty good in my opinion like long sleeves are 55 is it 55 yeah long sleeve 55 t-shirts 45 the bomber jacket that i had like the look of is 170 which is about the same price you would pay for like a stussy jacket maybe a bit cheaper the shaggy knit with the boiler room written on the back of it is 160 t-shirts again are 100 oh look oh sick they've got the scene from the boiler room oh sick from the K the legendary k Chinado boiler room it's probably the wrong it's probably the wrong frame though if i was being nitpicky i say it's the wrong frame it's the wrong screenshot maybe you'd want the frame where um where the girl to the left is sort of like her eyes are rolling and 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 catching others kind of looking at it a little bit like what the fuck's up with this girl i think that might be the best frame personally or maybe the girl didn't agree did she sign the release maybe she's not, she's not i don't think she's even a feature there actually oh no she's there she's there she's there but yeah that's pretty sick that's pretty sick iconic boiler room or legendary boiler room sets um you know emblazoned on the shirt there's an archangel t-shirt is 50 another big one that i like what's that one as well is that uh the dancer hood that's a really good one holy techno is a really good one and what's that is that is that a beer mat or a slip mat okay oh nice there's blog house t-shirts too not too fond of those ones 
Eurodance. I'm not too fond of those ones. But yeah, de decent stuff, honestly. The pricing is really good. There's so many good options to choose from if you want to wear like club wear stuff. Like, there's no need to like go to those like double R label nonsense and make them overpay you for a fucking baggy oversized t shirt. Allow it. Like, Boiler Room do great stuff as well. I think Hall have some decent merch out. I'm not sure Kindred do any good merch, but I think supporting these type of people is way better. Or just buying from Stussy and stuff. But really good shit from Boiler Room. Big up them. Love it, 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 love it. Love it. Love it.